All right, good morning everyone. Uh, Dr. Alex Hernandez from Life Chiropractic and Acupuncture. Today we're gonna explain what whiplash is. We're gonna keep this very simple. Uh, whiplash is an injury that occurs when the neck gets hyperextended and hyperflexed. So we're gonna take a look at the mechanism of this injury and why it creates pain. So looking at this gentleman here, you can see his neck hyperflexing. So basically this flexion motion is one of the parts that happens in a whiplash injury. The next motion, it's the hyperextension injury. Now, why this creates an injury is for the following reason. If we were to do this very slowly, there's actually no problems and we're not gonna injure ourselves. The problem is when the movement is extremely quickly, like when you get involved in a car accident. So everyone knows uh, if you ever get rear-ended, this rear-end collision and you're sitting in the front or you're sitting in the back, you're gonna have the seat belt and basically your body is going to do two things. First, it's gonna go backwards and then it's gonna go forwards, all right? And the reason for that is your body can't react to such a hard force. Not only does this happen in a car accident, but it also happens, it could be in a sports injury, playing soccer. It could be in football, you get struck from behind. It could also be in a roller coaster. So many times the head goes all over the place head goes back and forth and again because of the speed of how fast your head goes back and forth people get injured what do they injure here we go let's start with the muscles so we have a close-up we have our SCM muscle we have many other muscles in here your trapezius and these get injured you tear muscle fibers the next thing that you can injure is ligaments so if we look at the gentleman here, we can look at the back. There's a lot of ligaments in the back. There's a lot of ligaments in the front. You can injure your ligaments as well. Very, very common. And of course, you can injure the nerves. When you injure the nerves, you can injure, even injure the spinal cord, depending on how hard you got the whiplash. So uh, this is a very simple explanation. Later in a further video, we will talk about how it herniates this and what else it can cause. But what I want you to walk away with today is the fact that you get a whiplash does cause an injury and that leads to neck pain and it's something that needs to get properly diagnosed. As a chiropractic physician, we're highly trained in diagnosing whiplash injuries. So if you are experiencing any kind of pain, any kind of uh, shooting pain down the arms, this is a good opportunity for you to get checked by a chiropractor.